If you get this question right, you have five seconds to grab whatever you want. Once upon a time, pre-quarantine, one of the Bronx's tiniest residents got her paws on a bunch of free stuff because her math skills are far in advance of her six years. What's two times ten? Twenty. Five! At Lucky Candy, a bodega in the Bronx, quick math skills are the currency you need in order to make off with a haul like this. Bodega is a local store in your neighborhood. So it's like a general store that you can come in, grab whatever you need that you use on a daily basis. You got chips, bread, eggs, toothpaste. It's called the Bodega Challenge. Basically, customers come in and answer a math question. If they get it right, Ahmed Alwan gives them five very generous seconds to snatch up whatever they want at no cost to them. Two! I, I like that. Hi, Fluffy. Where's the Bodega Cat? Everybody has a cat. Bodega Cat is right here somewhere. Fluffy, this is the cat that um, one of the challenges, somebody tried to take her. Somebody tried to yeah. take the cat for a challenge? Yeah. <laughs> I take the cat. Yeah. <laughs> it's yours. I've been here for a while now, and it's like I know the customers since I was a child, and like these are low income families around here. You know, it's a great feeling to help. Well, when you saw the challenges on Instagram, what'd you think? I'm like, they're doing something good. Because here, like, we see a lot of people that don't really have anything. So it's like, mm -hmm. there's a good opportunity to get what they need. Yeah, that's right. Because right. they, even like when some customers come, they still look out. They feel like, yeah. don't worry about it. Yeah. Awesome. So now this is actually a challenge to like, let them have it. That's, that's great, especially yeah. here. What's nine times nine? Uh -huh. Plus 20. Okay. Minus 10. 91? Five! Hey, you scratch off? Three! Which one? That one, right there! <laughs> uh, another one! Another one! <laughs> another one! Yeah, give me both of them! Give me all, baby! I want it all! Ahmed's dad opened the store when he was a little kid. His family emigrated from Yemen, instilled in them their values to do and spread good. I'm passing on what my dad used to do, and he still does to this day. Like, his family's back home where we send money, monthly money to them, because, you know, they're low income families back home. There's not that much money out there in Yemen. It's a lot of people starving over there. And it makes me happy to do this stuff because, you know, I'm, I'm helping people. Like, it's a great feeling. I'm representing Islam, you know, and uh, it's like, it's a great feeling. So back then, neighborhood was a little crazy. You know, there's a lot of people over here that wanted to start problems and stuff. But since the school came, we've been here for like three years now. Kind of cleared up the area. You get this question right, you have five seconds to grab whatever you want. Are you ready? I'm ready. What's 12 times 12 plus 10? 144. All right. 12 times 12 is 144 plus 10 is 154. Go. Five. Four. Three. That's it? That's it, I'm straight. What? For a couple of months. How do you pay for all of that? They're taking, they have to come from somewhere. Yeah, it comes from my paycheck. Mm -hmm. So I pay it like my weekly paycheck. And I started a GoFundMe page where I raised a good amount of money now, where now I can support the community and support schools and support um, homeless centers. Yeah, and stuff. The Bodega Challenge even caught former President Obama's attention. Does he get to do the challenge? Barack, this is your appeal to President Barack Obama. If he comes through, are you going to give him like a softball question? Or are you going to give him a hard I'm give him a regular question. Not a hard, not a softball. If he wants to do it, that's great. Yeah, that'll be great, yeah. Does he get to pick whatever he wants? Of course, that's the president. <laughs> But when it comes to the kids, like what's the popular thing? What are kids eating now? Because you know, when we were growing up, it was like Doritos and Sour Patch. Kids like the chips. They go for the chips and the candy, but mostly the chips. I don't know, everybody runs towards the chips for some reason. Not me. So Stephanie from Inside Edition came through with the challenge. Are you ready? I'm ready as I'll ever be. What's 10 times 10 mm -hmm. plus 10 mm -hmm. plus 20? I guess. 130? Correct! Five! Ah! Oh my gosh, excuse me! Four! <laughs> ah! Three! <laughs> we gotta clean! Two! <laughs> I dropped it! One! <laughs> See, we gotta be practical. We are working adults here. I like that, I like that. The Bodega Challenge is not stopping because of the novel coronavirus pandemic. 
you have any kids, you can grab a board game and some Capri Sun books and a case of water if you want. Yeah, I got kids, man. So thank yeah. you. I appreciate it, man. No problem, man. My name's Alex. All right, Alex. You can do that. All right. Everybody stay safe. Stay alive. Yeah, you have to, man. Be careful. My um YouTube. Like, uh, I'm gonna start going to like homeless in the streets because I, you know, the GoFundMe, I raised a good amount of money where I could go to the streets and start like challenging people where they get the question right. I go buy them food, buy them clothes, buy them, you know, whatever they need. Clad with a mask and gloves, Ahmed still moving around the Bronx. His cheerful, giving spirit welcomed now more than ever. You get this question right, you get to pick up three things from the car. Are you ready? Mm -hmm. What's seven times seven? Plus 10. 7 times 7, 49. Plus 10, 59. Correct. You got gloves on, right? Yeah. yeah you pick up three things, whatever choices you want. Whatever you have, if you see somebody, just, ha just help. It doesn't matter how much. For InsideEdition.com, I'm Stephanie Officer.